So we've got windows that wrap all the way around this corner of the building. Chief District Court Judge Jay Corpening has experienced a lot of new recently. Not only is he proud of the new Juvenile Justice Center in New Hanover County, he also has a new perspective as a judge. When I start my day, I start with the sort of premise that everybody who walks through that door has experienced trauma. This new perspective is part of what's called a trauma-informed court system. The idea is to help people with trauma and prevent them from becoming entangled in the criminal justice system. I'm going to insist on accountability for misconduct or whatever the issue may be, but I'm going to treat these people with dignity and respect and I'm going to encourage them to be better. It's work that's come as a result of the Chief Justice's ACES Informed Task Force. The task force began in 2021 and its goal is to infuse the science of adverse childhood experiences or ACEs into the court system of North Carolina. One of the pilot programs is in District 5, which includes New Hanover and Pender counties. In the entire time I've been district attorney, I've never seen anything like this in terms of excitement by people seemingly from different backgrounds all coming together for the same thing. District Attorney Ben David says the goal is to attack the issue upstream. Children with high A scores are at higher risk of developing mental health concerns and substance misuse disorders, which can then turn into criminal justice events. For drug addiction and for mental illness, we need to find alternatives to incarceration and we need to be involved in therapeutic justice. In other words, navigating people to community-based alternatives. Blue seats because blue is the common color. We've got and with all the new going on, this is the work that Judge Jay Corpening says he's most excited about. That has brought a coalition together across the spectrum of, of, of silos in our community, bringing them together so that we're able to collaborate more effectively to be a healthy community. It's work that's providing help and hope to those who need it. For NC Impact, I'm David Hurst.